Welcome to If Xylo Turned Evil After Shadow Died, Part 2. It's been a while since I've been Part 1, but I just had a big brain blast, and I know how to bring us into Season 2. I know I skipped it. It's going to be like maybe a 4 part or maybe 5 at most. Alright, anyways. Well, that's, by the way, this is going to be a bit different than last time. I am going to be talking to myself like a crazy person. But at the same time, that's what YouTubers do when they go on. When they record something. Because no one's, they're not actually talking to anyone. Anyway, let's begin. Shing. This is for Shadow. This is what you deserve. That's taken care of. This world's... No, not the world. This camp has taken everything from me. I'll take everything from it. The next day. Oh, hey, Zylo. Oh, uh, hi, Mario. Uh, have you seen K around anywhere? Um, no, I haven't really seen her. Oh, okay. Um, by the way, uh, wh what's up with you, Aunt? What's up with you and K anyway? Uh, she doesn't really like me that well. Because I'm a son of Apollo. Oh. Yeah. Anyway, is that all? Uh, uh, yeah, it should be it. Alright, bye then. Okay, bye. Silo. Silo. What, 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 what? Calm down, Mario. What's wrong? Kayla's dead. Oh, yeah, I know. What? Yeah, I, I killed her. You, you killed Kay? Yeah, I mean, she tried to kill me. She killed my horse. She tried to kill me multiple times, actually. Yeah. You killed Kay. Yeah, I did. S Tyla, you... S you can't be here, then. Uh, no, I'm pretty sure I can. I've done everything I need to do. Taking the person that was trying to kill me. Hey, if you really want, I can bring her back. What? Oh, yeah. I'm a son of Hades, not Apollo. <sighs> I wonder why you're so evil. Hmm, yeah. Maybe it's... No, no. Can't be it. Maybe it's the fact that she tried to kill. Maybe it's the fact she tried to kill me a few times and then killed my horse, which is really the only other person other than you that's been nice to me. Not even my own brother. So, yeah, I don't think my father's at fault here. Dial? Yeah. I'm gonna have to take. <laughs> you. You think you can stop me? I know I can, huh? Hmm. Question, how's your lightning? Huh? <laughs> ah! Yeah, your reflexes aren't that good either. Ow! Drive this on for some- Whoa! Is that a ring of fire? Yep. Father gave it to me. It's like a defense mechanism, you know? Yeah. Alright. Just watch yourself, Silo. Mmm, I'm real threatened by you. Sparkles. Alright, bye. Over the next few months, Silo moved out of his cabin and found a cave that was almost suited for him. He made a new forge and even put the blood of Miss K into the forge. He placed his, her wings on his wall like a trophy, so if anyone would come in, 
they would see the wings. Eventually, rumor starts spreading around that Aphrodite's ball was coming up. A few people stayed in contact with Zylo, such as Jakey and Brandine. Those were pretty much the only two that knew where he lived. Not even Mitch, who used to be his old cabin mate, knew where he lived. Until one day... Huh? Who's the Bree and Brian? Hi. Oh, hello, Zylo. How are you today? Uh, doing fine. How how did you find this place? Well, we figured since you killed someone, you'd probably find a very dark alley or a dark place. And what's darker than a cave? Death. True. But I don't think you're dead. That's true, I'm not. No one in here could kill me. Um, so what do you need? Well, we wanted to ask you if you would like to come to the Aphrodite's Ball with us. <laughs> I'm banned from camp, remember? Wait, you are? I mean, not officially, but pretty much. Actually, I think Mario's the only one. Man, I probably totally ruined. No, he kind of wanted to keep everyone safe. He hasn't told anyone. Wait, what are, what are we even talking about? Oh, I killed K. Oh! Okay. Yeah, everyone knows that. Yeah, I know. So, is that a yes or a no? What am I going to get out of it? Well, first of all, you'll be able to see a lot more people than just Brick and Brandine. Oh, yeah, my brother. Yeah. Uh, anyways, anything else? No, that's really it. All right. Oh, my answer is... So, Brian pulls out the seductive rose. Brian? <laughs> Silo, you will come to the Aphrodite's Ball with me. And Bree. Why am I going with both of you? Well, we figured you're the strongest one. Camp are both kind of evil, apparently to everyone else. And, you know, you're the strongest one. Camp, so who's better to keep us safe than the strongest one? That's fair. Uh, sure. Let's go.